Hi, my name is Mary. I'm a Republican from California. I like to tell you what I want and what I need from the current president. What I want, I want him to speak in complete sentences. Don't think that's going to happen, so I'm not going to hold my breath. But more importantly, or most importantly, what I need, I need him to be honest. Now, he's proven unwilling, or in my opinion, incapable of telling the truth. Currently, our nation is facing so many serious situations. But the American people, we are strong and we're resilient. We'll face things head on, and given the opportunity, we'll succeed. But we can't succeed unless we're given real-time honesty, and we're not. There's many reasons that we shouldn't vote for Trump, from how he's divided the country to his disrespect for the military, and giving money to the military is not the same as respecting our servicemen and women. His disregard or his total disregard for science, how it's affected our climate change issues, and more importantly, how his disregard for science has affected the pandemic and the loss of life of our fellow countrymen. But I don't want to talk about him anymore. I want to talk about something positive. I want to tell you who I vote for and why I would vote for them. I will vote for someone who's honest, whether I like what they have to say or not. Someone who has the political experience and the temperament that the job requires. Somebody who has ethics, morals and values that they actually live by. So I'll take my vote, my Republican vote, and I will vote for Joe Biden and Kamala Harris. And I hope my fellow Republicans will do the same. So my last words this evening, to Donald J. Trump, they'll be his words. You're fired. <laughs>